WDBX 91.1 FM, Carbondale, and we have live in the studio Tim Crosby and James Ricks. Howdy. Tim. Hey. Do you have some upcoming gigs? We do. Me and this fellow sitting next to me have a, a show tomorrow uh, at Blue Sky Vineyards over there in Macanda at 2 to 5 p.m. tomorrow. And uh, we'll be lighting it up over there. So hope you can come by there. That's uh, pretty much the main show we have coming. We've got, I've got more, but that's like that's tomorrow. So I thought that's I'd tomorrow. Yeah, yeah, we can remember that. Yeah, exactly. I can't go much farther than that. I have to write everything down these days. <laughs> I understand. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Well, uh, we've got a song here. Uh, I guess the next couple songs are, are one. Well, this song and another song. This is these are both shaped by growing up in a very small town. And um, smaller than Carbondale. Much smaller than Carbondale. Smaller than Cobden? No, about the no, size of Anna. About the size of Anna, maybe. Okay, yeah. yeah. Uh, about 500 people. But the thing about all those small towns, and probably Carbondale sized towns as well, is that you, uh, you pretty much have to make your own fun there. You have to learn. To amuse yourself. That's right. While, while also simultaneously not killing yourself doing and, it. And you can't be too crazy because everybody's watching. That's right. That's right. Everybody that's, knows everybody. Some yeah. of the things you can get away with are um, astounding, and uh, you know your imagination gets uh, gets going that way to help you not not die of boredom. Sometimes. So that is kind of the name of this song here: is make your own fun. All right. One, two, three. Cars cruising slowly past a pizza joint. Kids behind the wheel wondering what's the point.
took that job welding down at ATM. Oh, having hopes and dreams is like a loaded gun. In a little tiny town, you gotta make your own fun. That's a word picture that we can all relate to, because I think yeah. we all did the same dumb stuff <laughs> and saved by our own dumb luck. Huh? Dumb luck. <laughs> no doubt. Yeah. It's bad when you can kind of count up on your hand, oh, I should have died that time, I could have died that time, um, I could have killed somebody else that time. I remember those moments. Yeah, Sometimes yeah. Uh, we recount those things just to know that we're still walking, talking, and lucky. <laughs> exactly. Just plain lucky. That's lucky. You're the luckiest of us all. That's right. <laughs> Everybody in this room. Uh, well, I guess this next song kind of is, uh, is about uh, someone whose luck runs out, I suppose. This is a song that uh, kind of describes a love triangle that uh, has gone wrong. They usually do and a flood in the wintertime, <laughs> intersecting in a tragic way. So this one is called Thunderstruck.
Disaster of almost <laughs> biblical proportions, man. It's a long one. Wow. <laughs> a lot of things happened. A lot of things happened in that song. Uh, I'd like to tighten it up, but oh well. That's just what happens sometimes. A lot of things going on, that's right. A lot of stuff happening. I don't know. By the way, you'd have to go quite a distance to find a better harmony singer for you. There's no doubt about that. There's no doubt about that. I think and he's last... handsome, too. Well, that's the best part. I know. Too bad we're not television, you know, because uh, we're really yeah. shy. I know. I have one of those faces made for radio, as they say. But he draws in the chicks. That's what happens. <laughs> I think the last time yeah. we were here, James said uh, that he was trained in vocals. That's what he claims. He sings the harmony so well. That's what he says. I haven't seen any, like, certificate or anything. Apparently he was. I believe him. Well, it's a good looks part. You're really impressed. That's people. right, exactly. Okay, well, we've got one here now. This is the city.